الحمد لله الذي أرسل الرسول بالهدى ودين الحق ليذر على دين كل وكفى بالله شهيدا وأشهد أن لا إله إلا الله وحده لا شريك له وأشهد أن محمدا عبده ورسوله أما بعد dreams dreams a lot of people get dreams some they get dreams frequently and they are confused they absolutely don't know who to go to who to approach for them for their dream to be answered or it will be continuous they get the dreams and the dreams are in three parts visions from allah and nightmares from shaitan and from oneself the oneself is the one you think daily about it and then you end up dreaming it and from the devil is the one you get nightmares and nightmares he bombards you it just makes you scared and from allah is to always the good dreams and the two are glad tiding and warning now a lot of people have dreams which indicate they have black magic but they are not worried about it some of them uh just don't know where to go some of them they go to the wrong people and they interpret it wrongly now today i'm going to point out about eight signs where if you dream of these know that you are inflicted with magic dream number 1 screaming in the sleep and you wake you know scared and shaky and sweaty this indicates there is a problem there screaming for help in the dream and no one is there to help you running screaming and crying in the dream frequently this indicates there is a problem there needs to be sorted you need to get help as soon as possible because the enemy is plotting against you the one who plots the one you you don't know it could be that someone who's very close to you dream number 2 is you dream of a thread tied in your cloth tied in your shoes tied in your hair tied in your door tied in your car tied in the toilet door tied in your arm tied in your fingers tied in your mouth tied in your private part this indicates there is a magic there you need to sort help as soon as possible the enemy is plotting the one who you know or the one who you don't know we ask a lot to make it easy for the brothers and sisters who are going through this get rokia done on you or read upon yourself dream number 3 you dream of knots knots in your bed knots on your arms not in your joints or all over your body knots in your belly knots in your private part knots in your hair knots in your eyes not in your head not in your cars not in your door not in your kitchen not in your business be wary the enemy is plotting protect yourself by reading adhkar's morning and evening and praying five times salah dream number 4 is you dream of talasum random writings you dream writings has been written in the paper writings written on the cloth writings written on the door writings written on the car writings written on the cooking pot writings written on the door of the kitchen on the door of the toilet random writing written on your shoes random writing is written on a book you are dreaming of reading them you don't know what sort of language it is random writings written on your picture be wary and know that this is a sign of magic you need to protect yourself and stay steadfast pray your five times salah read at car morning evening and get help get someone to interpret your dream this dreams needs to be frequent dream number 5 is you dreaming of padlocks you seen these padlocks frequently 
padlocks in your car, padlocks in your shoes, padlocks in your pictures, padlocks in the door of your room, padlocks in the door of your house, padlocks in your gates, padlocks in the kitchen, padlocks in the toilet door, padlocks on your arms, padlocks in your head, padlocks in your private part, padlocks in your stomach. Be wary. Someone is after you. Someone has done something on you. Someone has done something on you to protect you from having children. Someone has done something on you to protect you from your risk. Padlocks in your business. Someone has done something to remove or to stop you from having any relation. Or someone wants to separate you. Someone wants to lock you down. Be wary. Get a proper help and get someone to interpret your dreams. And pray five times salah and read a car morning and evening. And there's a clip down there in my channel to do self-diagnose. Dream number six is dreaming you being in the grave repeatedly. You digging the grave, you burying somebody, you putting pictures, you putting clothes in the grave, you being inside the grave, you can't come out screaming. You sitting in one grave or in the middle of the graves, you following a burial, going to the grave. This is a weary time and these are one of the most dangerous magics. Seek help and do a self-diagnose or seek help in the proper channels and pray your five times salah and do adhkar morning and evening. Dream number seven is you dreaming of chains. Chains all over your body, chains in your head, chains in your pictures, chains in your clothes, chains in your shoes, chains in your door, chains in your car, chains in your business place, chains in your door, outside door, your gates. This is a weary sign. You need to seek the correct help and the correct channel. You need to pray five times salah, adhkar morning, evening, and ask Allah to protect you from these evil plotters who are plotting to destroy your life. Dream number eight is seeing hair, hair coming out from your mouth with knots, hair coming out from your ears, hair coming out from your nose, hair when you're eating the food, you find out there's hair in the middle of the food, hair coming out from your private part, hair being tied on your arms, hair being tied on your elbows, on your shoulders, hair being tied on your stomach, hair being tied in your hair, hair being tied in your beard, hair being tied in your eyes, this is a weary time, you should be worried. This is a sign that there is a magic there. You should go and get Rukia help or read upon yourself and pray your five times salah and ask Allah to make it easy for you and protect you from those who are planning and plotting with this magic. These are the signs of magic when you dream. Your dream indicates that there is a problem there and you need to follow the correct channels and these are facts where you need to seek help and get treated or you need to treat yourself by calling upon Allah frequently and reading Quran frequently but remember no one can become his own doctor you need a doctor to treat you up I'm not saying you should not do the self ruqya Do the self ruqya but at the same time you go and find a sheikh to look what is your progress. Dreams are very nice. When you get dreams of good glad tidings, but when you get scary dreams from the devil, you get disturbed. You can't sleep during the day because you're worried. What's this dream? What's this? What's that? We ask Allah to protect us. We ask Allah to make it easy for us. 
Inshallah, there's an email there. I'll leave in the end of this clip. You can email me for counseling. For dreams interpretation, inshallah, there'll be more to come, inshallah, by the will of Allah. So stay tuned and share the clips and like the channel. وآخر دعوانا وسلام على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين